false advertising. Get out of here. Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a little bit different than my usual thing. I was thinking about what type of video I should make for you guys and this kind of came to mind and it was looking at things online um, for hamsters. So I'm going to be looking online at Amazon.ca and at .com, I think. And I'm just going to go through all of the hamster products they have. And I know there are going to be some weird things and maybe some things that upset people, such as cages that are really small. And yes, yeah, so I thought, let's go just looking, shopping for hamster stuff. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing I am going to be looking at, I'm not sure really what I should search in. So maybe we should just start out with hamsters toys. I think there's gonna be some cute things. Look at this. Oh my gosh. That is so cute, but I know no hamster would ever actually use. This is adorable. Look at how cute this is. No hamster would actually use this like this hamster is right now. I can guarantee you that. I can guarantee you a hamster would chew the heck out of this. It is really cute though. How much is this? $17.99 with free shipping. Uh, this is awesome too. This Rosewood Activity Assault. Why is it Assault? Assault course. I really want to get one of those. I think Basil would love that. He's a climber. Oh my goodness. What is this? Holy cow. Why don't I have this? But it's $50. This is adorable, but I feel like it's not actually made for hamsters. This person is just selling like a Barbie toy. Oh my gosh, this hamster. <laughs> His head is stuck. Somebody help him. This is really cute. This would be amazing for props. It is $50 though, so I don't know how I feel about that. There are, I love this bendy bridge right here. It's so long and so awesome. I feel like a lot of these things are going to be expensive. This is adorable too. I've seen this before, but I think they're really small from what I remember. There's just a lot of basic things on here, nothing too. Ooh, this is cool, $55. You wanna buy yourself a maze? <gasps> this is so cute. A supermarket hand, hand cart mini shopping cart, bird cat. Why does it say cat? You can't put a cat in this. This is tiny. Don't put a cat in that, guys. But I would get that for a hamster and use it for a photo shoot prop. That would be so adorable. We should sort it from high to low and let's see what the most expensive thing is. This has nothing to do with hamsters. Great. Uh, get. What the heck? Why is this raccoon? It's a pack of six. It's still $489. But it does have nothing to do with hamsters. Okay. Next thing I want to search up. I want to look at cages. I know I'm going to get really mad at a lot of these. Ooh, this actually doesn't look that bad. I, this cage actually looks large, maybe not. Uh, it looks pretty. It's a pretty cage. It's only $74. Oh, you can get it in different colors. Okay, this cage is totally different. Why are they selling it? Weird. One size. Where is the size? Um, oh, centimeters. Why do you have to put everything in centimeters? Now we need to... I want to figure out how big this cage is. We'll figure that out later. Oh, uh, have a trail. Too small. Too small. This cage right here only has like 160 square inches of floor space. Tiny. Ugh. I think this cage right here is the one that Pickles12807 got to show in a video. This thing is tiny. She said it has only 50 square inches of floor space. That's so ridiculous. It's $20. Save your money. <laughs> Ooh, this kind of looks... It is not that big. 360 centimeters. What? That's... Oh. Liars! They are liars! Why did they add those zeros? <gasps> I should complain about this. Look, the product dimensions are only 36 by 27 by 42.5. And on the thing, it says 360 by 20... 270 by 425. Liars! Who... Put false advertising. Get out of here. Some of these cages are so sad. Like this is $80 and I can guarantee you this is tiny. This circle cage, 
KT, what are you doing? Look at this. This is a lie because this is not the size an actual Syrian in this cage would be. A Syrian in this cage would be the same size as this wheel, I can guarantee you. Oh, this is, I think, yeah, this is the size. Oh my god. <laughs> This is one of the cages I recommend, I'm fairly sure it's the Savic Hamster he Heaven Metro Cage. I'm fairly certain this one is large enough. $564 Small Animal Modular Habitat. It doesn't even look that big, but I'm sure it actually... Oh, actually that is quite large, but I don't think anybody's going to be sending $564. What the heck? Cardboard carriers. For $500. How many do you get? Just one? Because I don't think that's really worth it. How many of these do you get? Should I order it, guys? <laughs> Ends up with like 500 cardboard carriers. Oh my gosh, I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna look at hamster cages again. I'm gonna go to a cage with a review and we're gonna look at the reviews and see what they say. This, I'm gonna look at this one. Oh, it only has one. Who gave this five stars? Who in their mind gave this five stars? I love these little cages. I bought two already. Everything fit well together with accessories. Oh my goodness. Who are you? I need to like email this person and tell them what is wrong with you. So this cage is tiny and it's like the other ones. It has three, oh my goodness, three people gave it five stars. Let us look at this. Super. We use this small cage for the hamster, okay, for traveling. My baby mice love it. I don't know if I would even use this for mice, this cage is still really small. Oh, someone did put a review on this circular cage. What did they say? Holy cow. Oh, okay, good. Very flimsy. A lot of wires were bent right out of the box. This looked like a wonderful design. In what world is this a wonderful design? <laughs> the doors open too easily, our hamster escapes unless we keep the doors locked. Your hamster's escaping because this cage is clearly too small. Thank you, who is this person? Roger, this is a good comment. Oh look, they even used, well this is the old size, but they were pretty up to date. This person, good job informing people, good job. <laughs> this isn't related to hamsters, but this is Lily's Kitchen's Truly Naturals Crunchy Tripe Sticks for Dogs. It's a pack of six. It's a thousand five hundred and nine 99 plus a hundred dollar shipping please tell me it's more than a pack of six it's a pack of six who is selling these yeah no wonder they have one star so yeah guys i hope this video has been enjoyable um i hope you enjoyed looking at products with me that are kind of ridiculous priced and maybe the cages are just like so small that it's like why are you even selling this but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Bye!